Hello, this is Fu from CMC Tech. I'm here today to show you some basic features and function of the Solo Remote Manager software. The first thing you're going to do is when you open it up, go ahead and right click on DVR site, go to site registration and add the DVR. If it's, if it's local, you can actually just search for it. Default password is 1234 for the channel. Right now I want channel 124. Once you add it, it should show up right here on the left hand side. Um, this you can just drag this over and it'll start playing. If you want to change the screen size, you can just click it here. Oops, I did it twice. Close all the channel. Let's go ahead and just zoom into four channels and drag it over. You can actually you can actually uh, drag individual channel wherever you like it. Let's say if I want a full sixteen view. Can you drag this down here and so on you can actually duplicate channels as well okay let's go ahead and close all this and just put one up if you if you see something and you want to do a, uh, a a backup right away you can click this little icon and this will actually back up what you're seeing on the screen directly to your computer and then you click on again to stop you can also take a snapshot and save it somewhere, let's say on your desktop. Once you're done with that, you can actually stop this. To do an actual playback on the DVR, click on this icon, this playback icon, and drag over your DVR. Once it connects, you can see the timeline at the bottom. Um, the orange indicates that there's, there's data, with continuous, continuous data. Um, it's color co uh, coordinated. Uh, green or blue should be a uh, motion, and orange is continuous. You can select the day and time. Blue day means that there's actual data on there. If you go back to the 21st, you can actually see that there's some data here. We click on it, we can actually see it. You can zoom in, zoom out. Four channels. Click over here to see, and so on. Let's stop that. Okay. The other way of accessing your data is if you go to your Internet Explorer, type in the IP address, and you should see the screen. Again, you can log in, admin one, one, two, three, four. It should come up with a little prompt. Go ahead and just install it. Once you install it, it should install pretty fairly quickly. There you go. Install. And the same screen pr pretty much comes up. Again, you can zoom in, zoom out right here. You can just play full mode. Channel. All channel connect. And it'll connect. And you can just play full mode. 16 mode down here as well. Zoom in certain channels. Play basic. You can go ahead and disconnect once you're done. Uh, these right here, these are pen tip zoom. If you have a pen tip zoom camera set up, you can actually control it here as well. If you want to do your configuration, you can go to configuration here. This is just your setting configuration, your DVR configuration. Record devices and so on pretty much the same the same information you uh, you would get on your uh, actual DVR itself you can do also do a playback if you go to playback mode again select the date and time let's say again the 21st you will see some data right here you click on it it should start playing back some data and so on And that should be it. That's how you would actually, and once you're done, just go ahead and log off. Once you're done. And that should be it. If you have any questions, just give us a call at 832-327-8880. Or you can email us at 
info at cctvfactory.com. Thank you.